scratches and I go, what the heck? And I'm bleeding. So my line busted open. actually up since like 6 30 um and I actually had a friend over and we basically sat on the balcony throughout the whole night um kind of separate so we have like that distance but to actually have some company and but be outside where you know we're in the air um and that was nice had a couple drinks and then yeah so anyway um I woke up at 6 30 this morning wide awake bright eyed bush and tailed and I decided to go outside and do some more work. So technically, this is my second uh, smoothie. Um, this morning, I actually had a, a full one, and that was like a half hour ago, and I actually just finished it a few minutes ago. So I made a half of one, and this time I put some dairy-free, uh, like, um, what do you call it, like whipped cream on top. I did not do that the first time. I just thought about it, give it a little different touch. Um, I'm going to run and pick up a load of dirt, but while I do that, when I get in the truck, I'm going to put you guys up and I'm going to talk to you about a situation that I just went through yesterday morning about my brand new port. Yes. Um, all right, so I, ooh, freckles, I am in my dad's old truck, <laughs> um, getting some black dirt for him. But um, I decided to tell you guys now while I wait for the people to load the truck up. Um, wow, that guy looks famous. Anyway, um, so yesterday I woke up, I had my port in, of course, everything's fine and dandy. And then I go outside to help my dad with some stuff. I'm not doing any crazy labor or anything like that, but I mean, it's been a week and it says for the first like 24 hours, don't lift this much. And for three three days, don't lift this. It was like day nine. And so um, I did lift some dirt, um, but for a weight that I'm able to carry without straining. So I'm not sure if that was the issue. The uh, nurse doesn't think that was the issue, but when I had, oh, hold on. Uh, two scoops. Yep, the black dirt. Yep. <laughs> um, so. The small bucket or the yard bucket? I think it's just the two thirds yard. Is it two thirds? Yep. Okay. Um, I think it's two dark thirds. Now I messed up. Yeah, two thirds. Okay. So, uh, sorry. <laughs> so, hold on, please. So, anyway, so I, I wake up and I do that. I then go back in the house, still pain free, and um, I get a. I get like an itch so I go and I'm like scratching now when I mean scratching I mean like I'm doing like this not like this I'm not freaking out because I know where it is and it's still painful but I'm like but when I do it all I do is like two you know scratches and I go what the heck and I'm bleeding so my line busted open and so I called the nurse it took an hour and a half for a nurse to come she took it out and realized that it wasn't the hole where the needle goes in, which she thought it, it wasn't, and I didn't think so. But my port moved further up, closer to my um, incision site. So the plastic that is like, flush to your skin um, for, uh, for the port was like even with the, uh, the incision site. So probably the pressure from maybe even sleeping on it and then moving my skin and the bones. Oh, there's the dirt. Oh, there it goes. My dog's getting scared of it, it's so bad. So anyway, so that's what happened. And uh, so she says because of my, oh my gosh, this dog is so scared. He's trying to go under my legs. babies um so anyways uh i took it out um it's still bloody 
um, ha most of the, the taping that was down, um, that like the glue and everything has been lifted. Uh, so basically she said that we're gonna keep it out for the weekend and wait till Monday and then reaccess it just to give it a break, let the this to dry up and um, everything. Oh, truck's moving and stuff like that. So going to the dog park and <laughs> they're crazy. So they know exactly what to do. They just never know which car to go to. So they kind of go in circles like this. This one, we're taking this one. Come on, boy. Where's your girlfriend? Freckles. There's my girl. I'm having issues with my booty area, my bowels, my butt. Um. I believe I told you that, you know, the last couple days, last few days, I've been having issues, um, or maybe I didn't, or I didn't go into detail, uh, but nonetheless, I've been having issues for about four days or so, um, and I had an accident, actually I've had two in the last few days, um, and some almost accidents, so that's, it's, it sucks because, you know, I'm kind of, you know, I got a break, which was great. Like any and every body party of the every part of my body needed a break. Um, so I'm happy about that, and I'd rather have that break than have that issue for so long. But it does suck because you know we still don't have an answer, um, or maybe we do. I don't know. It just it hurts. <laughs> you know. Um, I feel like I need like baby butt cream, you know, when you get rashes and stuff because it's constantly being used and it's just rough. Um, but I, um, so you guys probably have noticed the last few videos I've changed the intro music and that's because, um, now that I'm at certain subscribers, I was trying to get monetized and I couldn't and it didn't really give me an ex description, but I assume because my intro song was technically copyright. You don't get any, like, um, they don't take your, your stuff down or anything like that, but they do tell you each video that it's copyright, just so that you know. You don't get any strikes or anything. But I thought maybe that was the reason, so, um, but the thing is, is now that those videos are up and I want to be monetized, even though my, my intro is not copyright anymore, I don't know if that will change anything. I, I really don't know. I'm gonna have to do some more research. But nonetheless, I, I wanted to change it because I like to change my stuff up every so often, whether it be every six months, eight months, or a year. And so I changed that first and I wasn't sure if I was satisfied with it and I'm content. I'm not satisfied with the song, but I think I'll keep it for a while. But today, as you guys noticed, I uh, changed my intro, my intro song, and my like ending caption thing whatever that is so i hope you guys liked um i just wanted to use some updated video footage from the past like 2019 into 2020 instead of like stuff i've been just you know using i even use a lot of repeats and i tried to make sure i didn't do that so um yeah anyway but i am you know sitting here at my desk um Got a lot of stuff going on here, including the soda that's open. I'm drinking out of like this. And um, I'm enjoying some beautiful flowers. They were 10 bucks and on sale for $3. And the weird thing is I seen these. So I got them yesterday and it was the day before yesterday where they were like eight ninety seven, And I'm like $9. And then the next day they were three twenty seven, And I go, wow. <laughs> And I just think they're beautiful. Um, they're heavy, heavy duty, and they're just so pretty, aren't they? <laughs> anyway, um, I planned on um, recording my uh, first evening routine because I've asked about that. And a lot of people said yes, because you don't see that everywhere. People like morning routines, which I kind of wonder why one is more favored than the other. Um, and so my plan was to do that tonight. I don't know if I'm going to anymore because I have so much other stuff to do and it's already later in the, the evening and I just kind of want to relax. So I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. But if not tonight, I will for sure plan for doing that tomorrow evening. I spoke to um, a pain clinic 
and they are transferring me over to Mayo Pain Clinic. And in the meantime, I'm going to be going back to acupuncture and trigger point injections, which I'm very excited about um, because I believe it worked. I just don't know if it was the combination or the like one or the other. And so that will be happening whenever they're available to take appointments due to COVID. Um, I was so the, 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 I was prescribed prescribed um, a like ketamine lidocaine mix compound cream, but my insurance doesn't cover it, and it's 130 bucks. So I'm like, eh, I'm not picking that up. You guys can put that back in the system because I'm not taking it. Um, so that's unfortunate. And I have lidocaine, so I'm gonna call the doctor and ask her if she can just give me a higher mil uh, milligram and see if that works. Cause she told me mine was very low, so that could be an issue. Um, last but not least, I am going to be doing a whole new creation. Now that I'm gonna, I'm getting more into special effects, I um, I took out a whole new table just for my special, my special effects. I can't speak, so this is the table right now. Um, so I'm using that. It's right in front of the um, what do you call that window? And so I don't want to just do crazy makeup. I want it to kind of go. I want to like you know, do more with it. So I want to start making crowns and headpieces and maybe some jewelry. Since most of my photos, or if not all of them, they're all headshots. And um, some of them you don't, you only need just the makeup itself, but some of them I want more. And, you know, there's not, not, nothing to do. And yes, COVID is not gonna be here forever. And yes, I'll be going back to work, I hope. But I still want to get into it, and this is just a good reason to do it now. And then once everything is back to normal, I can still do it. Um, any hoot, I think I'm going to make Uno Mas uh, smoothie, which will be my third one today because they're so good. I never had kiwi in my. I never really had kiwi before. I don't think maybe once or twice, and it was. I think that made a, a really nice touch. So I think I'm gonna do that um, instead of eating dinner. I'm not necessarily hungry and that's it I know this vlog was very boring but I wanted to put up a vlog just to hang out with you guys it was absolutely boring I understand there was not much to it but you know life can't always be fun or you know tears so anyway um oh and my garden is officially well the, the garden itself is officially built and done and we finished most of the this uh the putting what do you call it? The the <laughs> oh, what do you call it? I'm not, I'm not saying dirt. The dirt down, dirt, dirt, dirt. The black dirt. So tomorrow we'll finish it fully, and then Monday I will uh, plant and seed. And if it rains, then we'll do it Monday, and then I'll finish it Tuesday. So that's great. I'm gonna go, and I'm going to hang out and just relax and do my thing. And I will see you guys next time. Peace. <laughs>